Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghuir. In this class, we discuss about list comprehensions. You know, previous classes we already discussed about what's list and how we create the list, all those things. This is one of the way to create the list. In Python, they have provided a concept called list comprehensions for writing elegant and user-friendly code. So let's take an examples and understand how we write the list comprehensions. So list comprehension consists of expressions and context in this we are having expressions and context so expressions and context let's take this example x is x power of 2 for x in range of 1 comma 7 if you write it in the in the list it will take for x in range of 1 to 7 means it will take 1 2 3 4 5 up to 6 and on this it will apply x power 2 so this part we call it as expression and this part we call it as context so what what happens here it is creating a list of 1 4 9 16 25 36 the same thing we can do using our uh, traditional way by using loops and uh, appending it to the list but this is one of the way for better writing of the code okay and uh, expression and context context con consists of arbitrary number of for and if statements uh, here we have written only one for loop uh, and we did not mention any if statement in our coming examples you will understand arbitrary means any number of uh, for and if statements uh, now coming to the second example x power of 2 for x in range of 1 comma 7 if x mod 2 is equal to 0 we have mentioned a condition x mod 2 is equal to 0 means uh, consider only the even numbers uh, if this condition applies then only this expression will be evaluated x star 2 so it is providing powers only for even numbers 4 16 and 36 uh, this is how we use and the coming to the next one employees is equal to we are taking a list uh, Rajesh 2000, Suresh 5000, Mahesh 7000 and Suras 9000. This is what our list we nested list and from this we are we are taking for x comma y in employees take the employees x is taken as rajesh y is taken as 2000 that is what x comma y means if y greater than 5000 means consider the list that the data that consists of y y means here this value greater than 5000 so for which mahesh 7000 suras 9000 these two will be considered so Mahesh X is displaying if you want to display Y we can display Y also here we are displaying only X so Mahesh Suras these two will be displayed and the next one Z X for X comma Y in employees if Y greater than 5000 if X is equal to Mahesh we have written any number of if statements means here this condition and this condition then only the out will be, uh, will be considered so that's why Mahesh is considered in the above example Mahesh and Suras here we have written two if statements both the conditions should be satisfied next coming to the similar to working of nested loops so this works similar to the nested loops we are creating x y values for x in range of 3 for y in range of 3 if x not equal to y so how nested loop works for x is equal to 1 x is a range of 3 means it will consider 0 1 2 for x is equal to 0 take all y values for x is equal to 1 take all y values for x is equal to 2 take all value y values this is how nested loops works the same way it will work but the condition here we mentioned if x not equal to y so what pairs will be considered 0 1 0 2 1 0 1 2 2 0 2 1 so we created a list and coming to the next if you want to create a nested list how we do that so in the list we have written that again one more list x for x in range of 5 what's this what's this statement is this is list comprehension x will take values from 0 to 0 1 2 3 and 4 coming to that next in this for y in range of 3 this execute for 3 times and and this will be displayed for 3 times that is how nested loops will be created so 0 1 2 3 4 0 1 2 3 4 0 1 2 3 4 we have created a nested list coming to the next one z x x if x mod 2 is equal to 1 else x minus 1 we can write the else part here also for x in range of 10 it is taking values from 0 1 2 3 so on up to 9 so what's the what's the values it is displaying if x mod 2 it is a even it is an odd number if it is an odd number so if uh, x mod 2 is equal to 1 
then display x else x minus 1 should be displayed so for that it is displaying minus 1 1 1 3 3 5 5 7 7 9 this is how it is displaying hope you understand the concept of list list comprehensions if you have any questions regarding the concept please post your questions in the comment section below thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates thank you